For today's lesson in science, we're going to describe the different seasons in the Philippines, Quarter 4, Module 3. At the end of this module, you are expected to name and describe the two seasons in the Philippines, identify the different factors affecting the seasons in the Philippines, and appreciate activities can take place during different seasons in the Philippines. Before we proceed with our discussion for today, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell for my future videos. What are the different seasons in the Philippines? But before that, let us first define what is a season. A season is a year that is distinguished by climate conditions. There are two seasons in the country, the wet and the dry season. It is based upon the amount of rainfall or precipitation. The first season in our country is the wet season. It is characterized by heavy rainfall and floods. It is during the wet season when the country experiences most of the storms. It is experienced during the month of May to December, but the heaviest downpour in most areas is from July to October locally. It is also known as Tagulan. The next season in the Philippines or in our country is the dry season. We experience very hot temperatures during the summer or dry season. It is locally known as Taginit or Tagtuyot. It is the season when the sun shines brightly and brings a lot of heat. In some places of the country, people experience the season from January to the early part of May. In other places, there is a short dry season, usually from March to May only. What are the factors that influence the season? One of these factors is the location. Philippines is a tropical country because of its location near the equator. It lies between 5 degrees to 20 degrees north of the equator. Since it is in the tropics, it receives more exposure to the sun. Earth's tilted axis at an angle of 23.5 degrees is another factor that causes the season. Throughout the year, different parts of Earth receive the sun's most direct rays. Sunlight influences the seasons, particularly the sun's position, and Earth's another surface that reflects the light. Another factor that affects season is the prevailing winds. It is a wind that blows in one particular direction. The two prevailing winds are the southwest monsoon, which is known as the Hanging Abagat, brings the rainy season, and the other one is the northeast monsoon or Hanging Amihan, which causes the dry season. Human activities are also influenced by the seasons. During dry season, people usually enjoy swimming and going to places with cold climate. It is also the time when farmers are usually harvesting and drying their crops under the sun. On the other hand, during wet season, people stay at home and enjoy different indoor activities. This season is a time when farmers are preparing their fields and planting their crops. After discussing our lesson for today, let us have our activity. All you have to do is to draw a cloud if the activity happens during the rainy season and a sun during the dry season. But before that, everybody get a piece of paper and a pencil. I will give you 5 seconds for every question. Are you ready? Let us begin. First question. Rene is excited to fly his kite in the field. Ready? Begin. Time's up. What is your answer? Alright, the answer is sun or it is experienced during the dry season. 
Next question. The children play sungka inside their house. Ready? Begin. Okay, time's up. What is your answer? Yes, it is experienced during the rainy season. Third question. The whole family strolls in the park. The whole family strolls in the park. Ready? Begin! Okay, time's up. What is your answer? Yes, sun. Because it is experienced during dry season. Next question. Father drinks plenty of water to prevent dehydration due to heat. Okay, ready? Begin! Okay, time's up. What is your answer? Very good. The answer is sun because you experience it during the dry season. Last question. Aling Bari dries their wet clothes in the backyard. Are you ready? Begin. Time's up. What is your answer? Yes, sun. Because it is experienced during dry season. Okay. So, there you have it. I hope that you have learned a lot from me today. Until next time, again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell for my future videos. This is Teacher Mart saying goodbye.